Elena, well, new details this morning into a house fire that turned deadly. It's a story we first brought you during our 11 p.m. newscast last night. A 21-month-old killed inside a home in the 300 block of Washington Avenue. We uh, may have a map of where that devastation occurred. Now, 23 ABC's Lauren Titus live outside the scorched house with what neighbors are saying about this heart-wrenching loss and the new developing details. Good morning, Larissa. It has been less than 12 hours since a fire ripped through this home you see behind me here, and already a small memorial has been built with just a candle and one small teddy bear for the 21-month-old toddler, Aiden McDonald, who died during last night's blaze. His autopsy is scheduled for sometime this week. I was in my room and I heard sirens going off. I come outside to check and I see all the, all the fire trucks and ambulances around. I didn't know anything of it until I came out here and I just see smoke coming out the window and then I see a family crying on the side and I didn't know what was going on. Anthony Lascano will be holding his loved ones a little closer this morning after witnessing a nearby neighbor lose their one year and nine month old son. While he says he doesn't know the family well, he can empathize their tragedy. It's kind of a, a sad thing to hear, and especially so close by, especially since I have four little brothers. So just imagine what they're going through right now to see just the feeling of losing a baby. Kern County fire officials say this deadly blaze started in the front room of this home at 620 last night, and it took more than 30 minutes to knock down the blaze in this two-story home. Firefighters were able to extinguish the fire before more homes fell victim, and now an investigation into the fire and the infant's death are underway. We just don't know what it is yet. It's still really early in the investigation, so as things become more and more uh, available, we'll make sure that we get it out. This investigation is very fresh, so stay tuned as we continue to work to bring you more details. In Oildale, Lauren Titus, 23 ABC.